Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 8th. So you know the timing is fluid. We're just going to see what I pick up for a message. This reading may or may not be for you. It is not sign specific. This is a general message for the energy that is coming in. It's likely to play out for some situation in your life. That's what I've been told anyway. So I do apologize for the delay. But now it's time. What I just saw was the King of Wands. So the King of Wands is an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius that is about to take action. It doesn't have to be that sign, but typically it's somebody that is very feisty, very fiery, um, that, that has a lot of confidence, that is very strong-willed and determined. So we have somebody here that is very determined, usually determined to win. So uh, this person is about to take action. Page of Wands, interesting. Uh, this is a little bit younger than the King of Wands, um, but very similar energy. Maybe a little bit less confident. Uh, maybe a little less likely to... Um, doesn't have as much experience as the King of Wands. So this could be somebody that's younger than a king. Could be somebody that is in their 20s or younger. Um, this is somebody that, um, you notice he's reaching up electricity. That's some sort of electricity here. So, um, so some sort of bolt of energy. So this person, this is a drive or ambition. Somebody gets, uh, uh, some sort of, it's very sudden as well. It could be a sudden desire to do something very exciting. They, this person has no fear. So we have somebody here that doesn't have any fear. You ridge up to into lightning. You've got to be fearless. So this is a very fearless individual here. So we have somebody here that is uh, reaching for something, reaching for something and has no fear. Okay. Hmm feels like there's, you know, this is some sort of electrocute. I mean, if you do this, if all I, what I just heard was electrocuted. Now, I don't know how that resonates, but the Page of Wands can be good news. Okay, this is, this is typically good news. Um, this could be a new suitor that bursts into your life. Somebody that's very well suited for you. Um... Does it have to be a fire sign? It can be anybody, but this is an it's an exciting opportunity either way. Um, somebody is is reaching for something, a connection. You know, that's a connection. Somebody is reaching for some sort of connection, which is interesting. This is some sort of news that is arriving. A message is coming. Okay, a message is coming. And, you know, maybe it's something you've been waiting for. Ace of Pentacles reversed. Page of Cups. We definitely have a message coming. There's no doubt about it. It seems to me like it's a good message. It's positive. Could be some, it could be a secret admirer. It could be somebody that has a crush. Somebody may feel a connection. This is like feeling, a, I feel like we have somebody here that feels a connection. Now, the Ace of Pentacles reverse is, is instability, insecure, um, a lost opportunity, typically in reversed. I want to get another card because, you know, on both sides, we have positive energy. So this is good news is coming. Some sort of good news is coming. But this Ace of Pentacles reverses uh, instability or insecurity. Somebody may be feel, they may feel insecure. Maybe even inadequate. 
You know, the Ace of Pentacles reversed is not solid, not stable, um, not really giving. Maybe, maybe they didn't ask for it. They didn't want it. Here it's come. It's coming anyway. Um, wasn't planned. It, there wasn't any plan for this. So there's there, there could be a new love. Could, this is a new suitor who you ha may have a lot in common with. Or it's a new exciting opportunity, period. doesn't have to be a suitor, but it looks like one to me. Um, this person may be expressing something. Uh, it looks like it's very sudden. It comes out of nowhere. It does. And it's not planned. It wasn't planned. But there's definitely a connection here. Now, somebody may be love struck. Okay, they may be love struck. Love struck. I just got it too. That's, ex that's what it is. Love struck. Wasn't planning for this. No, nope, definitely not. Knight of Pentacles. This Knight of Pentacles seems to be moving pretty fast. Ah, uh, jeez. Yeah. So this is somebody coming in with an offer or an invite or a proposal of some sort. And the Knight of Pentacles is a hard worker. Very skilled. Uh, very stable. Very um, practical and responsible. And uh, this person is outdoorsy. Um, domestic. Now he's got a pentacle in his hand. Maybe it's that may may have something for you. Somebody may have something for you. This person is definitely uh, planning something. Are they this is lack of a planning. Okay, this is no plan. But the Knight of Pentacles is very focused on their work. They're focused on their money. They're focused on their job. They may not be looking for love or they may not be looking for a relationship. This person is focused on financial stability. Very stable, solid, um, secure. Probably not, no plan of having this connection. That is exactly what we have going on here. Um, hmm. High Priestess. Page of Pentacles. Oh my God. We got three pages here. This, this is a new beginning. Okay, we have a new beginning that is very real. It is very, very, very real. It's like you did not ask for it. You did not, you, you weren't looking for it, but you, here it is. It's right here. It's in your hand. It is literally in your, it's like got dropped right in your hand, dropped right in front of you. All of a sudden, oh, here it is. Okay, that's exactly what we have here. You weren't looking for it. See, this Ace of Pentacles is being dropped right in somebody's hands okay so somebody is getting an opportunity and it was just it just came from 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 the sky okay it just fell out of the freaking sky um you see that ace of pentacles is being dropped right into somebody's hand so somebody is going to be receiving something that they did not expect they didn't even see it coming um now the high priestess is a loner this is this could be a healer a tarot reader Oh, a psychic, uh, somebody that teaches spirituality, an empath, somebody that is um, in touch with themselves and, you know, very in tune with the universe as well. Um, the, the high priestess is very alluring. She's very seductive and very... Um, doesn't need anybody self-sufficient independent so we have an independent person here who is receiving some sort of may have a secret admirer or may have a crush or somebody may have a crush on her they may like her they may uh have feelings for her or either way there's something coming this is a golden opportunity it's a new there's there's an opportunity to go down a new path and we have an individual that is going to be taking the steps okay it's like they 
they didn't plan on going down this road, but they're going to go down this road. The high priestess is also somebody who sometimes chooses to be alone. They don't they don't need anybody. I'd just rather be alone. But now they're being struck by a love connection. There is a love connection here. Um it's very, very real. It's definite with these pentacles. It's it's a real, real opportunity. Um, this is a new door opening. Somebody is being given an opportunity that could lead to something long term. It could lead to something stable. There's probably a sexual connection and a emotional connection, and it may have happened instantly. It could have been. It could be. You know. I hate to say it. I really do. I don't know. Maybe it's love at first sight. You know, I don't really like to say that kind of thing, but it definitely could be the case. Anyhow, there is definitely a message coming. Um, there is. There's a message coming, and I feel like uh, it's not going to be some. It's not going to be easy to start over because. Pages are starting kind of at the beginning, but there's an opportunity for uh, something solid. And I feel like we have an individual that is going to put in effort. They are. They're going to put in effort. They're going to take the opportunity and they're going to express some sort of desire okay whether it whether it's an invite or an offer it's an invite of some sort somebody may be invited to to do something um six of there's a gift here as well there is a gift this is a gift getting what you deserve we have somebody that is is going to give something They're going to be very generous. This is equality as well. This is an equal opportunity. It's an opportunity for both people. Wow, oh my God. Somebody's going to take charge. They're going to take charge and they're going to take an opportunity that has been dropped right in their lap. There's an opportunity that has been dropped right in their lap or right in their hands. And I think that they are going to put in effort to build something, to prove themselves or something like that. Five of Swords. Five of Swords. Now we have an individual that has chosen to be alone. The High Priestess typically chooses to be alone. This person has chosen to be alone because of previous hurt, betrayal. They've been burying themselves in their job, in their work, and not focusing on a relationship because of previous hurt. With the Five of Swords. In the past, they dealt with somebody that betrayed them, that... Uh, hurt them and that's why they, they've chosen to be alone but now there's some sort of love connection which is interesting death death reversed holding on is getting old there's a chance for a new life somebody has been resisting change they had no plan to start over. No plan to start over at all. Yeah, somebody, and maybe both people were, were choosing to be single. If they were, it feels like choosing to be, no plan to start over. No plan on falling in love. No plan. And that's when it comes. That's what they say. Anyhow, death is, um, death reversed is some sort of incident. It's a delay. It's a delay. Somebody may have been held back by fear. They may have been protecting themselves, choosing to be alone. But now they got this opportunity for something, for equal, you know, reciprocation. This is what they deserve 
for balance. It's like they've received a gift and they may see it as a gift. This is a gift from above. It really is a gift from above. Somebody has received a golden opportunity. It's like right in their hand. It's like, it's up to you. Are you going to take it or not? Are you going to take it or not? That's the question here. You know, so you're going to have to follow your intuition Follow your intuition. Use your gut. This is an opportunity to head towards something stable. You notice this person is headed towards the Knight of, of Pentacles, which is something stable. To lay a new foundation. The, the, the uh, Knight of Pentacles lays foundations. This is a super safe opportunity. It really is. And this person that is walking away from somebody that hurt them is walking right into, you know, something stable, something secure. But in leaving behind, you know, somebody that really, really hurt them. So anyway, I feel like there's going to be a message that is coming for sure with these pages. We got three pages here. There is a message that is coming that uh, this is from somebody that you may have connected with instantly. I feel like there's some sort of mutual, because there's equal give and take here. There's some sort of mutual um, attraction. I believe that there is. Um, mm. Oh my God. The chariot. Now this is moving. It's going to happen fast. Things are going to happen fast. This person may even arrive at your house or they come to your house and they pick you up and they take you somewhere. Okay. This is a ride. Taking a ride. Moving very, very fast. Um, headed towards balance, headed towards uh, receiving what you deserve. Somebody is headed towards somebody that is very generous, put it that way. This is a person that is generous. That is going to give them what they need. The, whoever is coming in is very determined. This person is determined. They are strong. Um, and they're going to take the lead. This person is going to take the lead. You could be dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius. A Pisces Cancer Scorpio. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. All I know is things are going to happen fast. This is moving forward, moving in a new direction. Taking the reins. Replacing fear with faith. Putting in, this is hard work. Somebody is going to be putting in the hard work. This is willpower. This is determination. Somebody is going to find their determination to get what they deserve. Whatever it is, they're good. They are. They're gonna. They are gonna find their determination. Very determined to bring balance to their lives and to get what they want. Somebody is definitely taking an opportunity that has been dropped right in their lap. It comes out of nowhere and it moves them forward. They weren't planning on it. It happens all of a sudden. There's a sudden desire to take control 
and go down a new path and they weren't planning on it they were not planning on it for at all it just happens all of a sudden that they want change i feel like we, it feels like that we have somebody here that wants change and it happens all of a sudden You know, the Page of Cups is like uh, Cupid bringing you an opportunity for love. So I do believe that there's an opportunity for love that comes out of nowhere. It's like it just bursts. It's like, like I said, it flies right in. It flies in out of nowhere. I also feel like somebody's going to be going somewhere in a car, okay, <laughs> which we do all the time anyway. But it feels like they're going to be taking a ride. They may be, they may be going for a ride with somebody. Maybe they're going on a date. Um, there's been a delay. There's been some sort of, but now is the time, okay? Now is the time. I know there's been a delay. It's funny, I started this reading out like that. This new life was but delayed. There was a delay. And maybe it was fear. Somebody may have been held back by fear and they were protecting themselves by being alone. They weren't looking for anybody. And well, here it is. I feel like, I feel like because this opportunity has been given, it's a, I got to do it now. I can't lose this opportunity. I, I, I got to take the opportunity before I lose it. This is, this is an opportunity that is too good to pass up. So I, I feel like somebody um, gets an opportunity. They may uh, be thinking about or they were procrastinating or they were held back by fear but they find their strength and their determination to grab the opportunity somebody is going to be given an opportunity and they are going to take it and they are going to run with it and it is going to lead to something solid it's going to lead to success it's going to lead to victory it's going to lead to uh, building a new foundation it could lead to love and a passion and, uh, you know, equal reciprocation. We have the three of wands on the bottom. This is get prepared. Somebody's going to have faith. This is hoping for the best, focusing on the future. Get prepared for an arrival. Somebody is going to move forward with faith into something that they're going to be given an opportunity that is very, very fruitful, put it that way. And I feel like it comes out of nowhere. This could, this could be a work opportunity or a relationship. Whatever is happening, it is definitely positive. Somebody was betrayed by by a person that uh, drained them, that belittled them, that uh, betrayed them, that made them feel less than worthy, that fought with them all the time, that pushed them away. The person that they pushed away is headed towards this Knight of Pentacles. This Knight of Pentacles is somebody that is, is safe. It's a safe option. This person is domestic. This person is responsible. Uh, they follow through. They're not uh, fly by the seat of their pants. They're headed towards something solid and stable. They're headed towards stability. They're headed towards an individual who doesn't give up. So I feel like we have a message that is coming that may be very exciting. Could be from a suitor, a new suitor. Catch the word new. That has uh, come out of nowhere that you weren't planning on. If you are in a coupled relationship, 
This may be about your job. This may be about, because this is a new opportunity. There is a new opportunity here that you are absolutely going to love. My advice is to take it and not let it slip away because now's the time. Remember I started this out. Sorry for the delay. Now's the time. Take it and run. Good luck.